these prices are dropping. NFTs are crashing. We are going low and can possibly go lower. I'm losing all my money and the worst is still to come. It's true, these NFTs have been crashing, but I couldn't be more excited because yeah, my NFTs are losing value by the day. It's so low I would have easily considered cashing out and calling it a day, but quitting is for losers. And if there's one thing I've learned about investing is that you buy when it's low and you sell when it's high. Everybody jumps into an investment when it's hot, but by then it's too late. The key is to invest before it takes off and becomes the hype. Most people don't get it. We put money into a project because a coworker made some money. But by the time we get into it, it's too late. We got in just at the right time to see our money disappear, leaving a bad taste in people's mouths because they don't understand the game. At the moment, my NFTs are losing value, but I just ride the wave. As it goes low and lower, I keep accumulating and accumulating, positioning myself so when the hype comes and everybody's mom wants a piece of the pie, I would be in position. It's easy to get discouraged. Shit, I feel like a loser when I open the app. I mean, you buy an item and the value decreases by the time you refresh the marketplace. But I don't panic. I have conviction and I have trust. Otherwise, you gotta get out. This isn't for you. This is not financial advice. But during this bearish market, you don't sell, you buy. And I don't mean you dump all your money in while it's low. I slowly buy as it's going down because you never know when the reversal will happen. So you have to adapt. You have to take advantage of the situation instead of crying. You need to fully understand and know what you're getting yourself into. This reminds me of a Warren Buffett quote. You need the right orientation. You know, 90% of the people, I'm putting the figure out of the air, but 90% of the people that buy stocks don't think of them the right way. They think about something that they hope goes up next week. <laughs> and they think about the market as something they hope goes up. And if it's down, they feel worse. I feel better. And you think about? I think about what the company's gonna be worth 10 or 20 years from now. And I hope it goes down when I buy it because I'll buy more. I try to keep my competitive spirit in a game where I can win. I don't get scared. I don't lose my competitive spirit. It's a cycle. We have ups and we have downs. Take a look around you. The world is in a fragile place. Crypto, stocks, shit is crashing. Exchanges are filing for bankruptcy. High gas prices. It's crazy out here. And even though we are in this current recession, Vivi still manages to sell thousands of items a week. It sells out within seconds, unless it's the Thor hammer. I believe in this company. It's mission, it's team, the community, all of you, we are strong. And even though we are hurting, I can still feel your excitement. And hopefully you guys can feel mine. We are the best NFT platform, the best, the premium, digital collectibles that are next level. We have the best looking items, the biggest intellectual properties in the world. They have simplified the barriers to entry, bypassing crypto wallets and complicated blockchains, the trust, the familiarity. We all have Apple products, the simplicity of being able to pick up the phone and enjoy the experience. It's revolutionary. Displaying your NFTs and AR, the technology behind this product is like no other. There is no competition cause we are the best here, but I'm not here to convince you. I'm just letting you know what time I'm on and what my thoughts are, my approach, and how I see the game. We're all excited for our NFTs to go to the moon. But are you really, really, really ready for it? Once we hit a bull market, are you completely satisfied with your current collection? Do you have enough items? Personally, no. I hope this bearish market drags on for the rest of the year. It only gives me more time to accumulate because... I have orientation and I'm not emotional, but don't take my word for it. I don't know much of anything, but what I do know is that Disney was here before me and Disney will be here after me, but I digress. Let's take a deep breath. One, two, three. If you guys are excited about Vivi as I am, go ahead, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. If you want to be friends on Vivi, look up Dr. Doom, mint number 0178, listed at 9 million gems.